maybe some players just don't want to be in the Bay Area because John Fisher and the Oakland A's <laughs> suck. They're so annoying, <laughs> and they treat their fan base terribly. They they tank their team for years, then they like double ticket prices just to say that they're not making money so that they can move to Vegas. So, are you sad? What, wh- who do you blame here? I mean, I know they've been very outspoken about trying to get this done for a while, and that is true. Yeah. They've tried to get it done for a while. I just don't know, especially in the last few years, if they've acted nicely or fairly in negotiations and haven't had their eyes set on Vegas the entire time because they get better tax breaks and think that the team's going to triple in value and they can sell it in a few years. Yeah, we really don't know exactly who's to blame here. I mean, to be a little bit fair, and and, and again, they have done a poor job with that ownership lately. I mean, all the different stories with the cheap food they try to give to the minor leaguers. uh, None of it's been good. That team is the worst in baseball. We've got probably a half dozen really terrible teams. They're easily the worst. I mean, no one could debate that at this point. Is it on purpose? You know, I'm not sure. I, they've, they've had a great front office. It's been able to win 90-plus games a bunch of times, but you can't do anything with this payroll and the way things are going right now. So, you know, it's hard to know who's to blame. I'm not writing it off completely yet because my understanding is that a lot of people were trying to hold Las Vegas out for an expansion team. And I'm wondering, does Las Vegas want the A's that badly that they're going to contribute? I mean, obviously, they got the Raiders. They've got the hockey team, which is they're all doing great. I mean, they know they're in line for an expansion team. Do you want a terrible team with a questionable owner coming in? I'm not so so sure it's a done deal just because they bought the land and they say the land deal is binding. You know, I'm I'm not going to completely give up hope. But, you know, obviously, Oakland's already lost two teams. It does appear as heading this way, and and certainly uh, you've got to think that ownership is at least partly to blame based on what's gone on in, in that uh, with that ownership over the past several years.